Hey, let's go Knights, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Shield! Woo! Nope. One last thing before we race, Nitzlock. See, I've got some great advice for you. You know how sometimes you see Pokemon? Yeah, yeah. If you crouch, they won't see you. But on the other hand, if you whistle at them, you'll be sure to catch their attention. So whistle if you ever want to scare them away. <laughs> if you're a bit what Russell, or, uh, rubbish at whistling, just remember, need a fail-proof trick, press the left stick. Try it out and let's see who can catch the most Pokemon. Well, I can't catch anything. You remember Wedgehurst Station, right? Where we went to pick up Lee before? That'll be the goal. See you there. Well, I can't catch anything here. And I can't catch anything on Route 1. Nope. <coughs> Sorry. My throat's rather dry. Look at all the people. Come on, it's lot. You'll never beat me to the station at that pace. So the way the wild area works is it's divided up into sections. I'm going to pick from uh, one Pokemon from each section, not pick. I'm going to do my Nuzlocke where I exclamation point it. Uh, standing encounters do not count. Obviously, if the Pokemon's too high level to catch, I'm going to... I'll get a redo at it when I actually can get to the level where I can catch them. I caught a really special one, and you, not one? What were you doing the whole time? You just, you going to want the team if you're trainer. Well, you see, I can't. Swift. Okay. Uh, with a TM like that, you can teach your Pokemon a new move in a flash, and you can use them again and again. That one will teach the move Swift, Lee gave it to me ages ago, and now it's yours. I've used it up and it's all scratched up, so HA! The gym challenge will begin in Motostunk. And our training train's waiting, so let's go. So if I ever do run out of Pokemon completely, I will that's the end of the Nuzlocke. <laughs> Not quite so fast, you two. What are you doing here, Mom? I knew this day was coming since the moment you chose Grookey as your partner, dear. Professor Magnolia was kind enough to let us know that you two were setting out. So here, a last little gift. See you all set on your way. All the kit you'll need for camping. Yeah, you can camp and become friends. and It's basically a Pokemon Center, which is the big deal. No matter what happens out there, if you and your partner are together, I know you'll be fine. Thanks, Mom. And just think of how lucky you are. Mothers to the first ever pair of champion brothers. Because I'm certain to be the champion next. You'll see. Hey, I could die. And you might actually get that chance. Of course you will be, darling. Anyway, do have fun and take care of yourselves. You'll be welcome back home anytime. We're off! Wish us luck, not that we need it. There are loads of brilliant trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. My excitement's running ahead of me even faster than that train can go, Nislock. Come on, we're off. I would like a dark type. So hopefully we get one of those. I wouldn't mind a fighting type either. Motostoke is surrounded by a vast wild area. It's a real sight. There are all sort of wild Pokemon just wandering about everywhere you look. I will say my favorite thing about this game is seeing the Pokemon in the open. Plus you can camp out, do a spot of fishing. I don't think I could ever get tired of it. The biggest issue I have is they put the Pokemon in the overworld, why couldn't they let us just have them follow us around? Hey, Station Master! Isn't this the wild area? What are we stopped here for? Yes, this is the wild station area station, make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train is halted due to a flock of Wooloo on the track. I think this is where I get my EV. What's there to be sorry about? This is brilliant! Brilliant? This world wild area is massive, there are loads of Pokemon no battle hill. Here. You get it, don't you, Nitzlock? This is the best play possible place to put together the greatest team. Okay. You have my EV. Oh. 
Nope, this is easy. Yay! Since I'm not, I'm not going to be using the EV or the mail, I just want to pick it up. Uh, that's a mail one, it looks like. No, that's actually... F yep, that's mail. Thanks to its unstable genetic makeup, this special Pokemon conceals many different possible evolutions. No nickname for you, Eevee. The Eevee I gave you is special, you know? You should definitely Dynamax it. Well, what we're gonna do... Oh, I don't have access to the PC thing yet. Um, that's when we get out here. So basically, each one of those blue dots is gonna give me a new area to catch. And look at all those raids. Which I'm probably not gonna be doing. <laughs> because if I do those raids, I definitely have to set some special rules for them. Look at that! Grass. That's Motostoke, way off that way. Between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Oh, hello, and if it isn't Sonya. My grand gave me a proper earful in her own way. Those two young trainers are setting out on a journey, but what are you doing with your life? Ouch, Professor. Ha, huh, never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourselves over. Besides, I've been quite curious about the Pokemon you two met in the forest. I'd been thinking I should look into it, so the timing works out fine. If I discover something really huge, then maybe even Gran will admit I've got some talent. Yikes, being an adult has got its own challenges, eh? I said you needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road. Really, it's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. Well, I'm off to go stick my head in as many of those red, red glowing dens as I can find. Hop, that's probably not safe. I'm going to battle a snot out of a bunch of Dynamax Pokemon and fill in another page in the tale of my legend. Hop, that really doesn't sound like a good idea. What cheek? Dynamax Pokemon are really on another level, you know. You better Dynamax your partner Pokemon too if you want to take on opponents that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that a red beam of light. If you think you're up to it, check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. side. So with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? Pokemon Box Link, that's exactly what I was looking for. So you, basically, I have a walking PC now. With a Pokemon Box Link, you'll be able to put Pokemon in your team, into boxes, or take Pokemon from your boxes, and add them to your team. Nice, right? So go wild, catch in as many Pokemon as you like, and fill in some more of your Pokedex. The wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of your real adventure. You are correct, because that's a lot of Pokemon to catch. Wait a minute, did I buy Pokeballs? Hmm. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so what do we got? First things first, EV. Yeah, yeah. Put you in. The, actually, I'm gonna move you to box eight. That way, I don't accidentally use you. Also, my team is all males. All right, rolling fields. Do I, which grass do I want to step in? Also, berry tree. Hop, oh, curry, visit berry tree who have berries. Alright. It's looking like I'm probably going to end up with comb bee. Also, I'm not going to count tree encounters because it's almost always the squirrel. Um, one more. Ah, it didn't count. Or it's not too rough. Yeah, like I said, it's always the squirrel, so if I wanted the squirrel, I could just gamble, or not gamble, but cheese the system. Uh, let's see how well you do with a quick attack. I'm gonna lose some of the berries that I knocked down, possibly all of them. Yeah, 
we go. Yay, hop leveled up. Alright. Did I lose them all? Oh, just the orange berries. Okay, so we got Chera and Pecha. Pecha? I think it's Pecha. Uh, I'm gonna use R. No, I guess I can use Hop. Hop didn't take that much damage. Oh, there's our exclamation point. What do we get? Oh, it's a bound sweep! I don't even remember how to uh, evolve that thing. Um, I think an ember might actually kill it, so let's quick attack it. Perfect. I think that actually lowers my special or regular attack, yeah. And there goes the control drift. I think a regular Pokeball will work. Hmm. Got the bounce sweep. Bounce sweep's data. Uh, when under attack, it secretes a sweet and delicious sweat. The scent only calls more enemies to it. Oh, you poor thing! I'm gonna name you Sundere because of what you evolve into. <laughs> Alright, we got a new Pokemon. Alright, so that was, I think, the Rolling Hills, right? Okay, yeah, that's Rolling Fields. Actually, can I catch anything back here. Look at that big old onyx. I was not expecting a bounce sweep in all honesty. Doesn't look like there's a fishing spot or anything. Alright. Just wanted to make sure. Alright. Next. Capture. Also, another one of my rules and I do this in every Nuzlocke is I've got to fight every trainer on the route. No purposely skipping them. Hey, no. Oh yeah, you can zoom out. Just trying to find our next spot. Penny Mushroom. Hi, lady. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't know what levels... The, the problem is with wild areas is these are random trainers. They, I don't know if these are like level 50 trainers. Now I know I said I'd purposely fight everything, but I'm not about to risk just instant loss. Okay, so... I'm gonna just follow the river here to the west. So let's get some lots. I've never fought trainers in the wild on my other game because they're not often. Oh, you wanna fight? Let's fight. Hey, that's a female combi. That's evasion, right? Burn! One more and it's dead. Oh, and I burned it. Nice. I've never used a combi before. Are they any good? Well, obviously not combi itself, but that's the one. This is so weird. Hmm, there's a purple right over there. I kind of want to poke my head into it. But I'd have to set a rule like a Pokemon KO'd in a raid, because... Oh, 
Okay, buddy. Uh, I think it's just normal at this point. Uh, let's see how well Ember does. Not very. I think that's guaranteed hit. Hopefully it's not a crit. <laughs> Okay, well, it screwed up and used Leer instead of attacking me, so I don't know. Yay, Sundari levels up. <coughs> Double kick? Heck yeah. Goodbye, technical. It's literally just a weaker, or not a weaker, but a lesser quick attack. So, yay, Sundari. Ooh, Rapid Speed. That got a massive buff. Oh, hey, speaking of Vespaquan. I think I'm going to use a potion. Actually, I'm, uh, oh, hold on. Big mushroom. I kind of want to connect online and just come across the random people. Ah! Is this not the next area? Huh. I saw, swore I saw a sparkle over here, but I guess I'm wrong. Oh, there we are, new area. Alright. Uh, this is going to be water types. Because it's raining. So, uh, Arthur. There we go. Oh, it's a Grubbin. I was not expecting that. Um, I guess I could just pack it. It's a level 12, so it should be able to tank it. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, I'm okay with you slowing me down. I just need to hit you one more time, and you're gonna hit me anyways. Did they buff string shot? I don't remember it being harshly before. Please don't crit. Alright. Hmm. Little Pokeball. Oh no! <laughs> it popped out! Oh, that was a lot of damage. Uh, please don't... Don't pop out and don't crit me. How do you evolve this thing in this game? There we go. Um, what do we call Grubbin? Nice, three bubble ups. Let's see. It uses its big jaws to dig nests into the forest floor, and it loves to feed on sweet trap sap uh, tree sap. Huh. Um. Uh, I'm gonna name you Pumba because he used to eat grubs. <laughs> you are what you eat, after all. I'm gonna just collect these watts. Yep, max raid battles, that is a, uh... Oh, mushroom. Hi, right, coming through. Holy crap, that is bright. 300 watts. Ooh, that is a, uh... Dew Fighter. And... Hey, it's Bounce Sweep. 
Revival herb. Fancy apple. Hey, I can camp now. Oh, we're in a new area. <laughs> Rare item for 100 watts. Let's see what we get. Ugh, XP candy. We get those from raids. Shake the berry tree! Chilon and Pecha. Roust? Only one? Two Oren and Roust. I'm gonna shake it again. Okay, I'm gonna stop here. That's ten berries I just got. <laughs> What is my HP looking at like? I'm gonna go ahead and rest. We're gonna make apple curry. Honestly, I don't like the idea of uh, doing this because it requires you to... or it increases affection. Let's start cooking. Got apples. And let's add one of these. Well, let's add one of everything. Ready. Alright. Let's get this cooking. Fan the flames! Grow f brighter, my flames! Ha! I need you over here. There we go. This should be at least three star. Yep, that's at least three star. One more Pokemon and we have a full team. Dry Apple Curry. That actually looks really fucking good. Yay, three star. So this will give me XP, make them more friendly to me, and it will also, most importantly, heal them. As you can see, it's not that much XP. Um, I don't want to step in the grass just yet. Ooh, annoy that. Alright, here we go. A snow run. Are you male or female? That's the, that's the important part. If you're female, I can turn you in. You're a female. Ooh, um, I'll I'll let you stay in for a second, uh, Arthur. Ooh, ice. What ice body? Oh, you little shit. Luckily, ice attacks at this level aren't affected by Leer. However, I am going to have to do more damage than this. You know what? I'm going to risk it and just throw a ball. Nope. Ooh. 
Oh, please don't kill it with hail. Oh my god, get out. Get out now! Um, yeah, hop, you're in. Hop sh should be able to ember it without killing it, because Hop's not a special attacker. <coughs> so that's what I'm going to do real quick. If I kill it, I lose my catch here. That's all it comes down to. But I have to do something. Okay. I can actually hit it again with Ember. As long as I don't crit... We're good. If I miss, I guess I throw a Pokeball. No crit. Okay, good. I'm gonna throw the Great Ball. I'll be able to buy them soon enough. And I'm starting to run low on health, and this thing's continuously healing. So, Great Ball. Oh my god, I hate you. Um... I gotta heal. Oh my god, that's gonna just keep healing on me. Bad potion. Why's it gotta be so difficult? Huh? Oh, you- and now you're lowering my defense? I need that! Especially when you're using physical attacks. Um... We'll use a Pokeball. I'm not even getting a single damn shake. Luckily, this isn't gonna do anything to me. It's gonna heal. I'm actually going to use Ember this turn. Hopefully, don't crit. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. I didn't burn and I didn't crit. That's the very important thing here. Okay, Hop takes a little bit of damage. Snow Run heals a little bit of damage. Pokeball, please. One, two, oh my god, I hate you! Oh god, this is what I'm actually worried about. Okay, we're fine, I gotta use another potion, but we're fine. I'm not losing my score, buddy, this early to a damn snow run! Oh, you're, you're just being an utter asshole, aren't you? Throw a Pokeball. Catch it, please. I can't keep this up. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. I'm gonna name this Yuki. Fury Attack. Should a move be forgotten for Fury Attack? Yeah, sure. Let's get rid of the lure. This thing was a pain in the ass to catch. It can only survive in cold areas. It bounces happily around even in environments as cold as negative 150 degrees Fahrenheit. Well, you're being called Yuki.
This is a new Pokemon for me, just not a new Pokemon this gen. Alright, let's go check these two towers. Oop, and we got a berry tree. Oh, hey, look, Delibird. One berry. Two berries. Alright, gotta stop. Two citrus and one luck. Oh, that was a really bad haul. Also, we're getting you the hell out of the lead. I do need a new... Because I have two bugs right now. I need one more for that situation. Oh, I'm not going to need that. <laughs> hey, get out of here. I don't want your presence. Uh, let's look. Count the ghastly. Hey, look, it's lowly. Oh, hey, this is a new area. Right? Where am I right now? West Lake Axfell. Oh, this is the water part, apparently. Yep, a little bit is on land. I can see it right there. So the bridge and... Alright, well... I could either save it for a water type, or I can just catch something now. And since I've got two bug types on my team, I'm going to catch something now. Also, I saved... What a habit. I already have a snow run. Am I sure I'm in a new area? Killing. Um, let me just double check. I, I have uh, the option to say no to that thing anyways. Yeah, I think I walked right back into... Oh no, that was Watchtower Ruins. Oh, wait a minute. Hang on a second. Was that area Westlake? Or was it Watchtower? It's looking like it was Watchtower. Okay, so this was Watchtower, where I caught the snow run. Yeah. Alright. Very safe assumption. Alright. Uh, let's keep searching over there then. If I keep getting snow runs, I'll just have to wait till later. Westlake Axel, or Axwell. Let's see if there's a fishing spot. It's a lake. Let's look at the water and look for a fishing spot. I might get a magic carp. Pungent root. Um. East Lake Axwell. Uh, let's look at my map. Did I catch something from here? I did not. So this is also a new area. And I don't see a spot on the water I could fish at. I'm gonna check across the bridge. So it might just be walking the grass. Never mind, fishing spot. What we got? It's a Magikarp. I thought it would be. <laughs> but hey, I guess this takes Magikarp off the table. I'm just throwing a ball. It's a Magikarp. One, two, three. Um. What do we want to call her? The weak and pathetic Pokemon gets easily pushed along rivers when there are strong currents. Poor Magikarp. Calling it weak and pathetic. Uh... I'm gonna name you Xeno. Because you're like the warrior princess. Um, now here's the question. Do we go with Pumbaa or Steven? 
I kind of want Steven because he's the new Pokemon. Pumba, I don't know even how they evolve in this. Um. Hmm. Steven or Pumba? Ah. I think I'm gonna go with Pumba for the type coverage because it turns into an electric type. So we're gonna get rid of Steven. There'll be time we can swap them in and out later. Alright, let's go get the East Lake. And then. Okay, so we've been here, we've been here, here. Okay, we need East Lake. North Lake, and Giant Seat, and South Lake. Oh, we actually have a lot more catches here than I thought. But these are really the only quote-unquote routes, so... We're gonna be ending up with a lot here. I'm not going to go... So, what I could do... Oh, uh, let me show it on the map is I could go up and around here and grab all these too, but I'm gonna just limit it until it sends me in that direction. Okay. Well, hey! It's a Growlithe! Oh, 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 oh. I need an exclamation point. There we go. What do we get? We get the good boy! Well, oh my god, the sun is... Oh my god, get out. Pumba, get out. Pumba, get out. Pumba, get out. Uh, pop, get in. Uh, the sun is bright. That means fire damage is gonna be off the charts right now. And it's a to bug a fire. See? Alright. Uh, we're gonna quick attack the Growlithe, because this shouldn't kill it. Okay, I can do one more. Oh god, please tell me you can't roar. Please tell me you can't roar. <gasps> Ooh, that hurt. Um, I should have rested. I should have rested. I should have rested. I should have rested. Ah! Alright, we're gonna use a potion. Uh, we have to use it on a hop. Hop can resist the fire attacks, and he can, I guess, tank the hits. Let's see, he's at 32 health. Oh my god, throw the ball and get in the ball. Okay, okay. Get in the ball, get in the ball. One, two, three, stay, stay. Yes, thank god. Oh, that was actually scary. Oh, that Growlithe buffed itself way too much. Alright. Extremely loyal, it will fearlessly bark at any opponent to protect its odor from harm. Oh, that's cute. Uh, it's a male, so we're gonna name it Pop-Tart. Because that's the name of my dog. Where do you want to send it? I want to see what it has. Is oh my god, is that a oh my god, it's adamant even? Holy shit, that was scary. Um, uh, yeah, you're gonna go to the PC for now though, because I want to use Hop. Good boy. You're my uh, you're my second PC Pokemon now. Um. Hey, no. I've been gathering the energy already. Alright, I think this is an area, a new one. Let's see. No, it's not. Alright. Let's run along here. 
So let's see, we're going to need a Thunderstone, I believe, and a Firestone. Because there's Growlithe. But not right now. Hmm. This is a new area, right? I didn't read the name. Yep, this is North Lake. Uh, what we're gonna do... See, instead of being dumb like we have been, we're gonna heal up Arthur some. And Yuki. There we go. Now we're not so dumb. Oh, I walked into a cat. Ooh, very strong looking no. Oh my god, did I get the Poke Doll? Please tell me I got po okay, I got a Poke Doll. Okay, so we're not catching over in this area yet. Very strong means they're above level. So I'm glad I bumped into the wrong one. Which is strange. Because I'm still within range. I guess this part is... Oh, I see. Because it's connected here. No. Because it gets cut off by the train track there. Yeah. Weird. Alright. Well, we'll know to come back. Meow to you too. Let's walk around the curve and check over there. Hmm. I could be causing myself a wipe right now. <laughs> Let's find out. This is a giant seat. <gasps> I'm screwed. I'm 100% screwed. Why is it so strong over here? Um, I'm gonna run, I guess. Oh, please keep enduring and let me run. Let me run, please. I'm dead. I don't... I'll let you guys decide if... That's dumb. Alright, well... Pumbaa, you're gonna sit in, uh... You're gonna, you're gonna sit in the box underneath Eevee there. Steven, you're back in, I guess. I need to level you up. Xena, I can't even put in front. Alright, let's just go. These areas aren't supposed to be that strong, because you can get to them from either direction. But, it apparently was. Oh man, there's a brilliant spot there. Put it back to this box. Well, back to having one backup Pokemon. I can't believe I got away with only one Pokemon death, though. I thought I was gonna wipe.
Well, <laughs> that's not good. Real ace of you to make it through the wild area. Seems like your trek ran your Pokemon ragged, though. You should pop into the Pokemon Center. That's what I was trying to do. Besides, there's someone in there I bet you'll get a real kick out of. You're a real trainer and all. Um, is it Santa? Oh, looks like the Rotom's for you. Rotomy are the kind of Rotom information service at the handy machine. Yeah, yeah. I can make a league card. The photo stoke sure is big, right? Not to worry, Sonya is here to show you around a bit. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> the uh, use card maker. Let's make a card. Oh man, I could put Leon on the back. You know, I kind of like that. Oh, that's like hollow foil, huh? Frame. Yeah. Let's go with the EVs, I guess, for now. Next step. I can zoom in and out. Uh, change expression. Change pose. Oh, yeah. But let's go uh, Dragon Ball it up. Ginyu Force. Berter! I was wondering if I could just put my back. <laughs> Don't show my face at all. Uh, change expression. Ha! Perfect. Clear coding. Print it! Our cards are even waterproof. Huzzah! Did I heal? I don't know if I healed. Let's heal. Comment down below, though, what what should happen with, uh, what's its name? I already, uh, gr uh, Pumba. Should Pumba be gone forever? Or should Pumba... Get a second chance. It's up to you guys. Yeah, help you. I'm here to buy. I want to buy like 11 more. <laughs> I have revised. Let's go sell them all. They're under this. Max revive. I don't need a single revive this rod. Probably only works to painted, so. Right. Hi, Sonya. So, brilliant young trainer who's braved the wild area. Do you remember what your goal in I'm here for the June challenge? By the way, the ceremony tomorrow is being held at Motostoke Stadium, okay? Okay. Use that lift over there to get to the stadium, okay? <coughs> well, laters, I'm going to swing by the shops while I'm here, but don't forget to register at the stadium, okay? Hmm. Ugh. I'm so salty right now. I hope the cafe is not too strong. I, I think it's level 15, so I should be able to handle it with hop. You can battle here once a day. Alright, let's go. Dwight, if that's your real name. 
You think he has a combi just to make it produce honey for him? It's only level 10. Oh, that poor thing. I get? Hey, I got a sweet. If I get an all creamy, I can evolve it. Or a milster, I mean. And you have a TM for me. Or TR, I guess. They're vintage. Charizard. I surely never make it to the stadium without you to show me the way, partner. Even with a huge old thing like this to bang in the middle of the city, I still get lost. Miss Lock, alright? No, I might have lost the Pokemon. One looks telling me you've become a trainer worthy of the endorsement I gave you. Ah, and yes, I reckon you might even be ready to use this. Here, try giving this to your partner to hold. Ooh, charcoal. You could take that lift up to the city's upper level if you're headed for the stadium next. Although charcoal doesn't help me much right now. <laughs> Do I have a silk scarf out of curiosity? Uh, other items. Nope, just the charcoal. Here you go, Hop. Luckily that works with any Pokemon. But no, uh, that's fire type. Hey, give me a Pokeball. No, not you. Not not you. You. The ball guy. You made it too? Motostoke Stadium. This is where the opening ceremony will be held. Everyone will be watching the opening ceremony for the gym challenge. My mom, your mom, the whole world. It's getting me a bit nervous, really. No, this isn't nerves. I'm only trembling because I'm so excited. Come on, Nitzlock, it's time the world learned our names. Okay. So I need to pick a number. I think I'm going to the Childish Route. Would you take a look at this? This place is packed with gym challengers. Every one of these folks is another rival. Let's get signed up. Eh, none of you are rivals to me. I'm too strong. <laughs> I will say, Nuzlocks are really more stressful than... Oh. Seriously? What a piece of work. If you're here to register for the gym challenge, I'll need to see your endorsement, please. Here you go. Fancy that. This is the first time we've had a challenger endorsed by the champion. Well, now you've had two, because I am as well. What? Two of you at once? I wonder what's come over Leon this year. The two of you must be something special. Yeah, he's my brother! I'm Hop. I'm Leon's little brother, in fact, and the next champion. Get me all signed up, would you? Well, yes, I am trying to, if you'll just give me a moment. There, you two have been successfully registered. You can now you choose your preferred number. It will be displayed on the back of your uniform. We all know what's happening. Number 69, is it very well? And here, please wear this gym band at all times to identify yourself as a gym challenger. The opening ceremony for the gym challenge is to be held here tomorrow. All the trainers taking part have been booked at a room at the nearby Badoo Drop-In. That's the league chairman for you, even booked us all hotel rooms. I'm off to check out the fancy digs. Oh yeah, I gotta fight. Shit. <laughs> um... I have a bug. Uh, Steven, you're up front. Uh, also, someone down in the comments let me know when I should evolve Yuki. 
I don't remember if it's like right away. You must be a challenger. It's down this way if you would be so kind to follow me. Uh, I know which way it is. You didn't even have me follow you, you just kind of walked off on your own. I'm gonna go grab this. Fuck you. Three burn heals. Well, luckily, it was one of my duplicate typings, or my, yeah, <laughs> repel. Uh, Challenger Nits, we have arrived at the Badu Drop Inn. Okay. Fancy. Try to get some rest and build your strength for what's to come. I'm actually worried right now. <laughs> Stupid walking. Looks like both your, you both got yourselves registered. Oh, hey, Sony, what are you doing at our hotel? I'm researching the mysterious Pokemon that are said to be in the Slumbering Weald. I reckon if I look into some of Galar's legend, I might find something out. Can you join me? You're already here. You're here already. Anyways. What's this, then? It's a statue of the hero who once saved the Gala region. I could run through the legend right quick if you fancy. The short version, please. Long ago, a great black storm covered the Gala region. People called it the darkest day. The land was assaulted by gigantic Pokemon, but they were defeated by a single young hero bearing a sword and a shield. The statue here is meant to depict the young hero of that legend. Huh. I suppose that hero must have been about as strong as Lee then. Looks like you're going to have your hands full with plenty of research though, Sonya. Black storms, swords, and shields and all? Will you be alright, Sonya? Of course they will. I'll muddle through somehow. Don't you worry. You two are staying here at the hotel tonight, though, aren't you? Shouldn't you check in? Probably so. And we'll look out for you too, Sonya. If we hear anything about any hero or whatnot, we'll tell you. Oh. Now we get to deal with these idiots. This is kind of bullshit for a Nuzlocke. I have to fight all four of them. Team Yell is here to help, after all. If you're in a fair battle, if you want to stop it. Alright, okay. Play this smart. Hopefully these guys aren't too strong and I can actually use Steven. Didn't we tell you, mate? You get in our way and you're in for a battle. Team Yell is all about helping. Helping one very special trainer win the gym challenge, that is. We want to make sure she gets cheered on nice and proper. And now you're going to help us make some noise. Uh, Team Young Goat. Let's go. Please don't be too high. Okay, you're perfect then. So Team Yell only uses Dark type. So Steven's going to be very good. Oh, you paralyzed! You've got to be kidding me! My luck this episode! Well, that one's dead. Went looking for a fight and I lost. I'm so pathetic. Yes, you are. Now get the hell out of the way. Good job, Steven. What? Steven is evolving. Actually, not so good a job. This is actually really bad timing. Your Steven evolved into Dottler. And here's why. It's now Psychic-type. 
As it grows inside its shell, it uses its psychic ability to monitor the outside world and prepare, prepare for evolution. It's actually kind of cool. Reflect, light screen, and confusion. Oi, give me a break here! Team Yellow, get revenge for me, would you? Okay, let's see how hard you guys hit. Of course I've got you covered, mate. What could be better than a battle in a lovely hotel lobby? Alright. You get one attack, Steven. Luckily it's a Nicket. Pure Dark type, still. A struggle Bug. And hopefully... Perfect. Paralyzed didn't ruin it. And that's even better, because Nikki is a special attacker. Now, I need this Paralyzed to go away. Nice. Paralyzed didn't affect it at all. Xena leveled up. You must have gotten a bit carried away being in this swanky hotel and all. Sorry for getting in your way. Aw oh, man, the swanky sophisticated air in here had me off my game. I couldn't keep my cool. I wasn't expecting checking in would be such a big fuss, Nick's fuck. What's going on? Sneaking in some Pokemon battles without me? I don't think you can get ahead of me that easily. I need to get some training in, so I'm joining you. Here, I'll even heal up your Pokemon. Nice, that gets rid of the Paralyzed. I'm Hop, one of this year's gym challengers, and the one who's going to be the next champion. Now let us have a nice 2 on 2. I can already hear my victory coming. The only sound you'll make is a whimper of defeat. This game has really good music. Go Steven! Go Wooloo! Thank god he's using the Wooloo though. Okay, that's not gonna do anything to me. And that's gonna do a nice chunk to him, nice. Ooh, Snarl. Okay, that did like 8 damage. Oh no, that lowers my special attack, you dick! Okay. That's actually helpful because Snarl is a special attack. Good, attack the Wooloo. Only attack the Wooloo. Zigzagoon is dead. That means I can't take any damage this turn. Struggle Bug! And it's dead. Perfect. Ooh, I crit it. My voice is unsure when I'm sad. I want to yell, but I'm unsure. Came to see the gym challenge opening ceremony, but this is awful. Guess it was defeat that I heard coming. I think I'm about to cry. What are you lot doing here? Marnie! Nothing. We was just... I know you are. You all are terribly curious about the other gym challengers. You gotta show a bit of restraint. Sorry about them, they're just a bunch of my fans. Call themselves Team Yell and follow me around, cheering for me. I think they've let it all go to their heads a bit. Come on, you lot, back home with you now. They're just so caught up with wanting to support me and all that, they tend to get a bit shirty with other gym challengers. Sorry if they caused you any trouble. So you're a gym challenger too? Team Yell, was it? Pretty impressive that you already have a set of... Uh, fans to call your own. Alright. We're going to call this episode here, us good nights. So hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and remember, us good nights, share the love.
Goodbye. Thank you guys for watching, and a huge thank you to my patrons. Without you guys, I wouldn't be able to make the content I do and do what I love to do. So thank you very much, and I'll see you guys next video. Goodbye.